Hi, Alfred. <laughs> oh, puppy. Sweet boy, I almost stepped on you. Hi, Betty. I just wanted to share the level of ridiculousness that I can completely recognize I have reached at this point. Hi, little lady. So it's a rainy day, very wet, puddles, all the things. The kitties out here, they don't like the rain. And I realized that I have a beach umbrella that I've never used. It took me this long to kind of, hi Ronan, to realize that I can give them a little bit of shelter. Look at that. I mean, come on. Here's the thing. I was outside. Actually, let me see if he's gonna come back. Okay, I was outside and Pat, Black Pat, was over here and it wasn't raining. Now it is, clearly. But it wasn't raining at the time. I mean, it like took a break. It's been raining all day, but it took a little lull. And he came over here. Oh, I see him. He ran over there, Pat. You see him through the trees over there? I was petting him right here and I grabbed his, his bowl to go get him some food, but then it just started raining again. And of course, cats don't like rain. And it was so cute because he went inside his little shelter in here for a second. But let's be honest, it's not ideal. It's been out here forever and I probably have to change the bedding. So he ran off and he took cover under the tree way over there. And that's when I remembered I had this thing and I was like, wait a second. Why have I never done this before? Probably because it hasn't, it hasn't really rained much. But anyway, so this is happening. This is to set up for when it rains. So I just wanted to share why. I don't know. Maybe somebody can gain something from this besides thinking I have better things to do. But, I, you know, that's all relative. I had a spare moment in my break during the day. Why not benefit the kitties? Now let's just try and get him over here to eat that food. Pat! I see you. Pat! Now I'm getting wet in the rain. See the sacrifices? Sacrifices we make? I see you. Hi, Pat. Okay, I'm gonna walk back in. Your food's out here though. You have shelter now. Hi, babe. Hi, boo-boo. They've been inside all day. Yes, dear. They're clearly just out here because I'm out here. And Betty, this little one, she has been so cuddly and clingy ever since the time change. They typically, their behavior change kind of changes kind of similar, you know, because they're so in tune with nature. It changes kind of similarly with the time changes <laughs> as it does with full moons and new moons, by the way. But the past few days, she has been sleeping on my stomach and sleeping on my chest. By the way, if you don't know, I have a hack on how to clean this up that's so efficient and easy. And actually, it's kind of kind of can be a good workout too if you want it to be, which is why I like it. I have a video on that. You could just search for it on the channel. But anyway, hi, Alfred. Yeah, you're special as ever. Back to work, but there you go. We're gonna have a good day here. Try and stay dry. Oh my gosh, wait. Hey, honey. I see my little Mrs. Dash. Oh, she's, I'm trying to tell her I have shelter for her. Come here, sweetie. I see you in that bush. When the rain slows down, you come on out here. She needs a place to hang out. Obviously no squirrels right now. Maybe I should just crouch down here and wait like a crazy person. I feel like my neighbor's out and I feel like he's uh, under the influence of some some gonj and he's probably staring at me like- Am I this high right now? Is my neighbor really crouching under this tent, trying to lure in all the cats? <sighs> yep. If somebody was to ask me, you know, what did you picture yourself doing in 2023 at this age? Like, what, what do you envision for yourself? Yes, I envisioned myself sitting under a beach umbrella that's used as a kitty protection tent as I speak into a small device holding kitty treats. Thank you for joining me on this journey. All right, I'm just gonna leave her treats right here because I really do have things to do. Hi! <laughs> if I can catch her coming and feeding under her little cabana, then I will post it. <laughs> oh, very sweet, sweet girl. Okay, say bye, puppy Do. I love you. <laughs> what are you doing? Since when do you do this? Oh, she's definitely got some, come down here. Oh, for crying out loud, who is she? Mrs. Dash. Hey, what are you doing? It's dangerous. Oh, oh no. Okay, Betty, this is giving me flashbacks. I hope there's not a bird nest up there. Don't be a cat right now. I can't handle it. Come here. Come down. Good girl. Oh, sh she's like, what did I do? Come here. Come here, little one. Do you? Oh, good girl. Oh my gosh, that's really narrow. Let's go. Oh sh**. Oh my gosh. Come on. You can do it. Come on, crazy. 
Come, come. Do you want more dry treats? Is this why you're doing this? Oh, for goodness sake. Okay, point made. Oh my gosh. Ronan, here, I know, I know. There, you have a couple. And then I'll give her, um, where is she? Oh, for crying out loud. Oh, that was very acrobatic. Hey, come on down. <laughs> oh my gosh, what was that? What was that? Were you showing off? Were you being a little kitty cat? Okay, hop on up there if you want your treats. You know what to do. No, you just want love to know? You want a little good job? Good job. Give me a heart attack. There you go. Here, baby. Okay. Congratulations. You're a cat. Crazy. Don't eat my squirrels. Oh, someone's loafing. You being a turkey? Oh, shoot. You being a turkey meditating? Hi! Oh, the over the shoulder. You're so handsome and stoic, Puppet Jew. All right, yeah, 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 yeah. It's time for me to eat my dinner. You enjoy your cabana, sweet girl.